you guys are going to show me what a cuddle this is. <laughs> Shakespeare's Garden that are, have marijuana resin on them. He's publishing the whole thing in a paper. It's called Doobie or Not Doobie. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So there's an iPhone in outer space now. Did you hear about this? That's pretty cool. Uh, I guess the astronauts aren't all that impressed. Uh, in space, the Angry Birds never come back down. <laughs> uh, <it was> fun. <laughs> um, so, I hope we're all healed from the uh, from the, the riots, the big hockey riots. It was tragic. Uh, I saw some shocking stuff down there, man. Uh, I saw this woman smash a window on Holt Renfrew, grab a five thousand dollar bag, and take off down the street. I was like, "What? Five thousand dollars for a bag?" <laughs> yeah. So my wife and I are trying to adopt a baby. Yes. Yeah, it's a long process, man. Um, I think my wife's starting to crack a bit. I caught her at the mall last week, uh, walking up to pregnant ladies. Well, are you going to keep that? <laughs> oh, here, this is nasty. I got a gross story. You'll love this. Uh, apparently, restaurants are having a problem with men missing the toilet because they're texting while urinating. Gross, right? Don't worry. Apple's got you covered. They got a new genital bib coming out. It's called the IP. <laughs> oh, come on, sorry, sorry. But, uh, no, I'm all about product innovation. You know, like, especially if it's got anything to do with barbecuing. I love to barbecue. It's finally barbecue season. But folks, when are we going to end the charade and admit that relish is not a squeezable condiment? <laughs> <laughs> Real estate in this town, right? Real estate? Barely? Barely? Um, yeah, I mean, people are taking out these hundred year mortgages to buy these tiny condos in Yale Town. I ordered a pizza the other day. Guy comes to the door, he's trying to sell me a house. He says he's a real estate agent on the side. Does anybody remember the good old days when the pizza guy used to just sell drugs on the side? <laughs> So uh, I fly a lot. I just came from the airport. I don't know if anybody here flies much, but they are charging extra fees for everything there. They will charge you for extra bags. They'll charge you for extra leg room. Even security is charging for extra lube. <laughs> you want to pay that fee. <laughs> Oh, Snoop Dogg, the rapper, uh, he's, he's branching out, he's coming out with a line of ice cream, it's called Snoop Scoops, clever name, I know. Uh, his buddy Flavor Flav apparently is getting in the action, he's coming out with a line of lollipops called Suck My Clock. <laughs> oh, uh, sad, sad story, I don't know if you heard this, the uh, oldest woman in the world, 114 years old, she's died. Yeah. The tragic part is she only had five years left and she would have paid off her Yale Town condo. <laughs> and, uh, anybody hear about this uh, guy who had a wart on his finger and he shot it off with a shotgun? <laughs> it's true, he, he took off most of his finger. Luckily though, the police got to him before the vasectomy. <laughs> Rice Krispies? Any Rice Krispies yeah. fans? Yeah. yeah. Breakfast cereal, right? Well, 
Well, if you bought Rice Krispies in 2009, you might have just won a class action lawsuit. I just heard it on the radio, $15 because uh, Rice Krispies aren't as healthy as they say on the box. Yeah. Uh, the sad thing is though, to pay for the lawsuit, Snap and pop and have to turn to selling crackle. <laughs> That's my time, folks. Thank you very much.